So Jay and I are home from vacation. We we came home and we had we did the ride home was really smooth, which I am always anxious when we leave Bar Harbor what the ride home is going to be like. So I'm going to do a couple of vlogs, one with the vacation footage, um, and then one with what's happened since I've been home. And um, we've got a couple of different things coming up, so maybe I'll add footage for that as well. But I just wanted to let you know that some of this might be out of order, right? Because you might be seeing, I'm going to like review something that you might see that review before you see this where I talk about getting it or vice versa. I don't know. We'll see how I'm going to piece it all together. But we do. We had a great time. And hopefully by the time you see this, you will have seen the vacation vlog. We had a great time. Um, I was super diligent about wearing a hat or a visor like I have on now. Super diligent about that and sunblock and, and all of that stuff. I... Um, I tried to, while I was gone, a girlfriend of mine got, she was able to pick up the Trader Joe Super, um, Super Goop dupe because I really love the Super Goop, the invisible one that you wear on your face. I love it. It, it, goes, it goes so well um, under my makeup and it's invisible, literally, and it's like a 40 SPF. So I really, really love it, but it is pricey. But it is probably hands down the number one sunblock that I have found that any any foundation or anything I wear, um, it works wonderful with. So I'm in love with that. So my girlfriend was able to pick up two of the Trader Joe dupes. Now I'm pretty sure you'll see this before you see that, but because I haven't got it yet because we're going there next weekend. So. Um, I'm going to film a couple of videos, and then of course I'll film that once I get it as well. But I'm super excited about it because the price is so much cheaper than the Super Goop. And if it is uh, as good as the Super Goop with my makeup and all that, I'm going to be, I'm going to be thrilled. Because to me, my, right now I'm in my backyard, but I'm standing in the shade. Well, there's a little bit of sun here, but I am standing in the shade mostly. Um, but to me, it's it's... You know, after having gone through a Mohs surgery, I don't ever want to go through that again, <laughs> ever. No, <clears throat> I don't ever want to go through that again. So, and I know that what I'm doing now isn't going to prevent that from happening to me in the future again, because I know that the damage that um, I did when I was younger is what I'm paying for today. So, um, yeah. Anyways, so this will be a vlog. A little bit of what's happening in my life so I hope you join me and again if some things are out of order I apologize but thank you so much for joining me and I will see you in a little bit <laughs> I brought my tomatoes with me when we went camping <laughs> and I had them in the motorhome and behind the motorhome and I was able to have tomatoes the whole time we were away and when we came home the only I didn't bring this. I didn't. This is the one plant I feel really bad. I killed it. It's parsley. Um, then when we came home, I put my tomato plants back here. And the little orange cherry ones. Oh my gosh, they're all starting to bloom again. I love them. So, poor Jay. so we've had this project. We've been out here. We've been working in, in the shop here. Um, Jay, this pool table. I don't even know how old this pool table is. But we're, you know, Jay's gonna try to see. We think we have the pieces up in the attic for it. Um, yeah, so this has just been one of his little projects that he's been doing, trying to clean it off. This was in storage, and this right here is the worst part of the wood. All the other pieces of the wood are perfectly fine. But that's just discolored, and I'm not too sure what it looks like on the other side. You know, that's the inside. I have a funny feeling it's discolored on the other side as well, but I'm not sure. So anyways, that's, that's Heppy's project. Yeah, and this is the, the shop area we've been working on. Oh my gosh, has this been a project. Unbelievable amount of work that we've done here. And still, we still have a little bit left to do, but you know. So I'm, I, I know. I mentioned in one of my other videos that I had ordered the Apple Watch bracelets. I got them in. Oh my gosh. Uh, when I go inside, I'll, um, 
I'll film a little bit of it, but I haven't put it on yet. But I'm so excited. I think they're so cute. So I think I'm going to put, this obviously goes on each part of it and you wrap this band around and then tie it apparently with this. I, have this. I think it's cute. We'll see how it looks, but the, you wrap that band around a couple of times and I also got this one. I haven't opened up this one yet. I like the colors. I think it's gonna be 90 degrees or 95 degrees. And um, Jay and I are heading, we're actually heading to a place called Rumney, New Hampshire, which is about maybe, um, hmm, maybe two hours from our house. So we're going up there to celebrate a birthday party, my girlfriend's mother. And uh, it's going to be fun. They, um, yeah, they live. They live way up there in the in the sticks, basically, in the in the foothills of the mountains and uh, the riverfront. So <laughs> Jay may go swimming in the river. I don't know if I will. But anyways, that's what we're doing today. Oh, and here is the one of the bands that I put on my Apple Watch. The other one is prettier. I should have put that one on, but I don't want to take this off and start all over again. So we've been on the road for I don't know how long, but we've had traffic. It's been a, it's been a while since Jay and I've come up 93 on a weekend, <laughs> right? So we had a little bit of the Saturday weekender traffic. We usually, when we go away for the weekend, end up leaving like on a Thursday. Thursday. You know, he takes the boat home ahead of time and all that, but... See, this is the exit I was thinking of. Oh, exit 24? Yeah. But it does say 25. Yeah, 25. But anyways, so hopefully um, we're going to be a little bit late for the event, but that's okay. Better late than never, right? right? Yeah, we left, we left the house at 20 minutes of 11. We had to stop, you know, at the store. By the time we got to Route 101, it was like quarter past 11, so we've only been on really on the main road uh, for an hour and 10 minutes, 15 minutes. So. True. That's true. So, yeah. Are you going to go swimming in the river? I don't know. You might. A little swim hole. Huh? This is kind of cool. Yeah. A little, uh, little float here. So he found a place to relax. It'd be interesting to see him try to get out of the hammock. A ah, piece of cake. Piece of cake? Yeah. Huh. Are you going to film me getting out? I wish I'd filmed him trying to get out, but he actually did good. He got out and we just had a wonderful afternoon. We sat around, we walked to the river, we had food, and then... We left. We left early, about 4 o'clock, for our ride south. So we needed a stretch break. We had a great afternoon, I thought, and um, it was really a lot of fun up there, and Jay took some drone footage. So the the property is butts a river. Was it the Baker River? And um, they had like a swim hole. We didn't, we didn't go in, but I took some video clips and some pictures down there. It was really nice. And it was hot. So we are in Auburn by the side of the road. <laughs> right, sweetie poo? We needed to have a stretch break. We really did. It was like, a, you know, it's a drive. About an hour ago. We make an excellent time. Yeah. Excellent time. Look at my watch band. Ooh, I love it. So I got the two new rip skirts in. I'm not too sure if I, yeah, I don't know what order everything's going to be in, but these are the two new. They just arrived. Um, I really wanted to, I was really looking forward to trying this design because this particular one, the blue dahlia print was out of order, back order for a long time. So I got it in. I got the size two again, the length two. This is what the Velcro looks like. Um, super comfortable to wear, easy to get in and out of. 
you know, I can imagine that if you have, uh, if, if I keep thinking, if I had these skirts when I broke my ankle and I was in a cast for so long, how easy it would have been to get dressed. Because <laughs> I love this, the, the idea. Super comfortable to wear. Now this one, I expect it to be a little bit more pink. It's also the Dahlia print, but it's a different, um, you know, a different color than the blue. I like the blue better. I'm probably going to keep both of them because I just love the whole rip skirt concept. Jay and I are going to go camping. We're not going camping Labor Day. We're actually staying home because we still have so much work to do in, in the farmer's machine shop. Um... So we're not gonna we're not gonna go camping Labor Day weekend. We're, I'm gonna have a little barbecue here, and my family's gonna come. So the weekend after that, we're going camping to Bailey's. So we'll see. And then <clears throat> we went to Ann's house on Sunday. My girlfriend, yeah. she's the one that picked up the Trader Joe's daily facial sunscreen, which I am reviewing. I don't know which video you'll see first, whether it's this vlog or that. I think it's gonna be this one. I absolutely love the Super Goop. The Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen. And it's probably the only one that really works super awesome with my dry skin. I love it. And then Anne also, she had bought this. And she did not like it because it does have a little bit of a scent. But this is the Trader Joe's Ultra Moisturizing Hand Cream. I found... Did I use it? I can't remember if I used it or not today. Uh, but anyways, I found it to be actually very nice. The scent didn't bother me at all. So she gave me that. She's very, very scent sensitive, doesn't wear perfume, etc. So I liked it. I didn't think the scent was bad um, at all. I really did like it. So I don't know. I don't know which video you're going to see first, but, um, you know, a little cheat or sneak peek in case this one comes first or that one comes first. You see this? Pick it up pick it up. So anyways, that was my two rip skirts. Um, we did go to the second barbecue on Sunday where I picked that up. It was a crazy, crazy week and because we had two barbecues, Sunday was super fun and then um, we drove home and we went down the coast, uh, superimposed a couple of shots that I did here just as we drove down the coast. It was kind of an uneventful ride home. We didn't, we didn't really do anything. We made one quick stop at Northside Park, which is my favorite place. I took a couple of pictures. And then we just, we just moseyed on home. That's what we did. <laughs> so as you can see, we drove down the coast. It was a beautiful ride, and we did stop in Northside Park. I'll put a couple of pictures in at the end of this. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the vlog and wrap up this video. It was a crazy busy week, and I know not super exciting to watch for a lot of people. But I thank you for joining me, and I thank you for watching. If you did to the end, that's awesome. If not, I appreciate the thumbs up. I appreciate a comment. And I will see you in my next video. I'm not too sure which one that will be, but... See you in my next video. And thanks for all your support. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Much love to you.